go, my eyes. Have a look, Sunan. hair gets longer, the nails grow, even when the corpse is cold. I've seen That's it myself. Not true. You think what? There's a bit of life left in someone long dead. No, it's the fumes in the body. Odors grow after a killing, so they have to escape by any means they can. Eivor, my muscle banded friend! There's a nest of Bigman's men just here. We're going to pick it clean. Every last one. The fewer lies in the bush, the less itchy the pussycat. That's how I see it. 
How did you come to join Soma's army? I'd been in England for ages before Guthrum, Ivar, Uppa... ...smuggling under the eyes of Saxons and Danes alike. I lied, stole, had my nose broken. Life wasn't easy, but it taught me how to bear the pain. I just laughed it away. When Soma took me in, she saw more than a smuggler in me. I was useful to something greater than myself. Useful to her vision. In a world where few saw you as worthy of trust, she's one who did. Right. And I love that about her. I love... ...everything about her. You seem to bring life and spirit to this clan. Does Soma feel the same? If I knew what was going on in another person's head... ...I'd find life dreadful and dull. But Soma seems to enjoy my company. In what way? Her own way. Just not in the way I'd like. Painful truths are easy to bear when you can laugh, you see. Delight in the face of suffering is an act of rebellion. What do you think of Soma's other warriors? Galen and Leif? Oh, Leif's got that raw animal pull. Every time I see him, I want him to climb me like a tree and nest in my armpits. He brays about being honorable. But I've never met a man of honor who starts a fire just to be praised for putting it out. And Galen, he broods like it's an art form. He's got this self-importance that is just so charming. We could talk all day, but these Saxons may fly from their nest. You and I should take a closer look. My men will hang back and come running if things go sideways. Fighting beside you should bring a thrill. Happy I can see it up close. Don't get too close. I might black your eye or bruise your head. <laughs> You'd lose your elbow before the bruises showed. This place is heavily guarded. More noise than Ragnarok's end, and these Saxons still don't see you. Not everyone is so fox eared as you. More's the pity. Something going on. Might be tucked in the chaff. carries over snowdrifts. I learned young. I practiced by sneaking in and out of bedroom windows every chance I had.
Jesus. What's happening? doesn't make it subtle. Thanks. That's all of them. Ah, the solitude of after slaughter. Shame of about the smell, though. Men shitting themselves. You fought very well, Birna. Is that how you flirt, Eivor? Is that how I what? Easy now, Drengir. I'll see you back in Grand Bridge.
See my wares. You always bring the strangest things. This could be very useful. You would look very powerful with that. You look stronger already. Yes, this is a good look. Nothing else? I'll see you later, friend. Eivor, the plan worked. One of Wigman's captains caught him sniffing around Euroli Ponte. Remember, you don't need to kill him. Have fun. I'll be planning our next move in the Longhouse. Little boy, little boy, where is your daddy hiding? Godless heathens. Grand Bridge is the province of Lord Wigman of Walden. The city is rightfully his. Poor soldier. Doesn't know what heathens do to men of God like him. Hasn't heard the stories, it seems. We can educate him. Look at those ham hands. Could make a nice pair of gloves. And his heart. A heart that beats in a lad like this? Feed a family of six for a week. Let's cut his throat now and water the orchards with his blood. No, oh, sweet lord, no! No, no! He's on the Isle of Ely, Elderman Wigmund, in the monastery, I swear. Hmm, thought that would take till the next morn. Let's tie him up and let him rot away. Oh, fucking Dane Hapwitz! The Lord will smite you from this land, all of you! May God have mercy on- <laughs> That home-thieving snake might have cast a curse on us. I couldn't risk it. Christians don't curse. Wickman's on the Isle of Ely. I'll tell Soma what we've learned. What did Wigman's little man have to tell us? Wigman is at the monastery on the Isle of Ely, hiding among the church mice. I'll need to plan our attack. 
But I won't face him while the traitor he commands is still under my roof. So what have you learned? Birna is in love with you. Unanswered love is a volcanic emotion. Birna has always been unpredictable. But she's a warrior grown. She does not let her emotions guide her actions. Birna used to be a smuggler. Hardly an honorable life. There is honor among even the lowliest of men. Danes know that better than most. Leif wishes he had stepped up to lead, and to be where you are now. Leif has a celebrated place in my clan. As a shipbuilder, he is without peer, and he knows I know this. Leif told me his yellow paint had been stolen. Yellow is a troublesome color to make. He was upset when his stores were stolen. I found an empty barrel of yellow paint beside a longboat launch. Yellow paint was used to mark a boat the night of the attack. An odd time for a fresh coat of paint. But that's his work, is it not? Gallen puts his visions above everything, to the point of fanaticism. Visions are like clouds. Each person sees a different meaning in the shape. And Gallen sees an important meaning. Gallen told me he was near death when you found him, and saved his life. Yes. People thought him cursed. He was adrift in deep water. But don't we all deserve a guide back to the shallows? Your secret tunnel had many footprints nearby, and its mouth was painted with a yellow mark. Whoever betrayed you, they did so by marking the tunnel entrance, then opening the way to let the Saxons in. That's all the evidence I think we need. You've been thorough. Who is the traitor? Gallen betrayed you. Are you certain? This will be the hardest thing I have ever done. Stay close by me, Eivor. I will need you. How do you plan to deal with this? As a leader must. My family, my inner circle. Today we make sure what has happened to us will never happen again. We end Wigman's life. But not all together, for you cannot survive the winter with a rat in your larder. Galen, you have betrayed me, Galen. I haven't! Soma, you're the key to my life. You must lead me to my destiny, carry me to the summit of victory! Do not warp what is real with the stories you tell yourself. I have seen no signs of your destiny. What I have seen is my people <sighs> slaughtered, my city befouled, and your delusions fueling the destruction. How dare you think your destiny, your greatness, outweighed all of ours! <gasps> he believed too much in fate, and not enough in us. Take him away. I feel as if I have torn off my own arm. Wickman deserves death. But killing him won't make your family whole again. You think I don't know? This is for those who follow. To join me is to take an oath. To break it is to suffer. We make camp on the outskirts of the Isle of Ely. Join us there.
carries the weight of leadership on one shoulder and the bonds of her people on the other. Now that she's lost one, she walks lopsided. It will take years of toil to rebuild those bonds with her people. Yet she is unburdened now. Lighter. She's a leader, not a friend, Abel. Her mistake was thinking she could be both. Come on, I need the challenger!